She's selling you out, Chief. She's got the plans. They're fake. We're not building a battering ram. No, but they'll think we are. And while they spend their time shoring up the front gate, we'll proceed with the real attack. And by dawn, Red Wall will be mine. <laughs> How many summers it's been since any mouse walked these halls? Untold generations, I'm sure. Have you noticed we still seem to be going down? Down indeed. This is the farthest underground I've ever been. This must be it. Martin's tomb. It may well be. But how do we get inside? Look up there. More old writing. Can you read it, Methuselah? The same as the steps betwixt the hall, remember and look to the center of all. Look to the center of all. Uh, maybe we should all go in together. And you think this is a fake? It's too easy, especially coming from Sella and Chickenheart. It sounds as though they went to great personal risk. Do you want to place the fate of Redwall Abbey in that pair's hands? This plan is meant to distract us, Abbot, nothing more. So, what do you suggest we do? Turn the tables. Use it to our own advantage. By mounting a counterattack now, when they least expect it. I'm sorry, Constance. To mount an unprovoked attack? I'm afraid I could never sanction that. We'll have to think of something else. Silence! While the defenders inside Redwall prepare for an attack at their front door, we will enter Redwall by a different route. For the entranceway to Red Wall lies not above the ground, but below it. The way into Red Wall is through a tunnel, a tunnel you will dig tonight. Why aren't you digging? Yes, sir! Martin's tomb. You look a lot like him, Matthias. He does bear an uncanny resemblance. The door! We're locked in! Matthias, Martin's shield. And look there, his belt. Can you see the sword? Alas, no. Try it on. No, I can't. I couldn't. Do you really think I should? It's a perfect fit. A perfect fit indeed. Now the shield. There can be no doubt, young Matthias. Methuselah, there must be some mistake. I am a mere mouse. There's no mistake, Matthias. You are the next great defender of Redwall. Not if we don't find a way out of here. Ah, there you are. <sighs> Mr. Formo told me I'd find you lot down here. I say, beastly dank old place, hey, what? We have to act now. It may be the last chance we have. But it is not our way. Let us concentrate on fortifying the front gate. You are making a mistake. Seller and Chickenhound will do anything for money. Oh, no! I left them alone in the Great Hall. I'll look after them. The rest of you, finish this. Come to some agreement. Father Abbot, Constance is right. I agreed we can't attack, but we can take other steps to defend ourselves. Can't we? 
Well... If the plans are a ruse, shouldn't we be trying to find out how Clooney is going to get into Redwall? This would satisfy you? Anything. So long as we don't just stand here. We'd better spread out and start looking. But what are we looking for, old bean? I don't know. But I'm sure we'll know when we see it. Strange. I feel like something been digging. Good news, Chief. We're under the Abbey Courtyard. About time. Down the hall, all of you. Any last orders, Chief? Just one. Win or die. You there. What are you doing? Stop! Stop! Help! Oh! 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 Is he dead? Who cares? Let's get out of here! Leave them to the others. Why? Matthias, there's bad news. What's happened? It's old Methuselah. Is he? No, he's alive. But he's badly hurt. Matthias, I've words to speak with you. It was Chicken Hound, wasn't it? Him and Sella. Probably, but that doesn't matter right now. Yes, it does. I know you're hurting, Matthias, but you can't let your pain blind you. Cornflower's right. Well, what am I supposed to do? Ask yourself the important question. Who's really behind this? Clooney? Yes. Where is Clooney? Master Matthias, them words is what I've been trying to speak in. I think I know where him is. What? Feel him? Someone down below be digging. <gasps> Father Abbott, could you please get everyone together, quickly? Of course, my son. What are we having for breakfast? Matthias, this really isn't the time to be thinking of food. Cornflour. All right. Um, porridge. Hot porridge? Everyone, and with porridge yet. <laughs> well done. How is Methuselah? Only time will tell. And what about this traitor? Oh dear. Yes, I suppose there must be some form of punishment, mustn't there? Bury her up to her neck in red ants, then hang the wretch from the tower before you draw and quarter her? Or we could let her go. Are you crazy? Not really, but Clooney is. I'm sure he will know how to deal with her. Uh, now, wait a minute. There's no need for that. Uh, I'm sure we can come to a better arrangement. I, I, I can be of great service. I'm a healer, after all. I'm a If I were you, I'd run.